Hey, hey everyone, everyone. Welcome, welcome back, back to Five and Eats. All right, guys, we are on day four of mashed potato week here on Five and Eats, and today we have the Hungry Jack mashed potatoes made with 100% real Idaho potatoes. Now, this one differs from some of the others in that it seems to only come in a big box of it. So the 15.3 ounce box of it was 288 at Walmart, whereas the others came in like the little pouches, you know? Now this one also differs in that they want you to add butter and water and salt and milk. So the others did not have anything other than the water added to them. So this one, you gotta put a little bit more work into, but I'm hoping maybe it will mean that it tastes a little bit more authentic. So this is a brand I've never seen before. Really? Yeah. Really? Yeah. So wow. this is very fascinating because it says, Basic American Foods is who manufactures this. Oh boy. And they're out of Walnut Creek, California. Oh boy, I don't Basic know Basic about... American food. <laughs> is that not like a California assessment of like middle America? I feel like that is. This is weird, this is very weird. Now these seem very creamy though. Yeah, and the packaging is very basic. Yes. I like the name though, Hungry, Hungry Jack. Hungry Jack, now just, I've seen this before. To us guys, I feel like it just screams to us, just says, eat this, you will be satisfied. Now here's the thing also, these actually look like flakes of potato, whereas the other ones in the pouches, they were more like a finely like milled, kind of like they looked like grits a little bit, like very, very small. This was like big flakes. And guys, if you're new to our channel, basically we review everyday grocery items. So before you spend your hard earned money, let us tell you if it's worth it. Let's try this out. If you'd like to support this channel, the easiest way to do that is using our Amazon links the next time you shop there. All right guys, welcome back our rating system. Thumbs up, we buy it again. Thumbs down, we would not. So for me, this is a thumbs up. Shocking here, this is pretty good. Look, you get a big box like this for a good value. The thing is, it's very creamy, it's buttery. It doesn't taste chemically like some of the others. Mm. This is not bad. If you were to blindfold me, I would probably not know this is out of a box. Pretty good, thumbs up. Now, I just wanna add this because this, as I was eating it, I was thinking about this. The only thing I can really complain about this, it's pretty salty. Okay. Um, so for me, this one is going to be a thumbs up. This is not bad, actually. This is a really good boxed, pouched mashed potato. It's very, very smooth, which is the one thing that I don't like about it, which if you like a smooth potato, then, you know, by all means, you'd probably love this. But I think of all of the like pouch mashed potatoes, it is the smoothest. Like it's very, very smooth. Whereas the others, they had some texture to them. But aside from that, the actual flavor is good. It's very buttery, which I had to add a crap ton of my own butter to it. So it had better be buttery. And it is. Now the saltiness, they recommended an amount of salt and that's what I put in it. But if I was making mashed potatoes on my own, that's like the last thing that I add and I just kind of taste along the way. So I probably would have adjusted the amount of that. But following their directions, I don't think it was too bad. I, I was okay with the salt level on there. Not bad at all for me. I think that this is pretty good. It does not taste chemically or artificial or anything. It's just a very, like very smoothly blended mashed potato that you could make at home. To sum it up, thumbs up, thumbs up. And if you guys buy from Amazon, use our Amazon link. The reason is when you do that, we get 10 cents, 50 cents, possibly even a dollar, which means we can continue to review things. All right, guys, that's the video. If you like what we're doing here, definitely check out our other channel, Food Prep Inc. And don't forget to give us a like and subscribe.